boys. It's time. We crow and age ourselves up again. Because we're gonna be speedrunning the Jackbox Party Pack 1. The original. The game that was made famous. When timing starts for the Jackbox Party Pack 1, timing starts upon actually hitting ENTER to start the game. Instead... Instead of when timing usually starts upon hitting PLAY. That's because there is no PLAY button in the Jackbox Party Pack 1. Um, in fact, the only act uh, only button with the word play is the Jackbox.tv, if this is the only pack you've ever played. However, I have an experience Jackbox pack running experience. You can use your keyboard buttons. Why? <laughs> and yes, you don't and yes, this pack released in 2014. The actual you <laughs> the at Google Jackbox.tv. I'm opening it up on my phone because the first game requires three players. Words, but only requires two. That means I only need my phone and an edge. Edge. Jesus Christ! Lice water allows a hundred players. What the hell? <laughs> A hundred players! Jesus! <laughs> Two. Two. You don't know Jack is the only game in where we don't need the multiplayer function for. Damn! Timing starts right now. As you can see, yet the game immediately starts connecting to Jackbox Game Services. DVDV. I forgot you need to send pictures of yourself. Uh. Ah! Hey! Three, two, one. Oh. Hello there. This there is one. Drawful. Wow, three player game. I like it. Everybody will get three shots at drawing something not terrible. It's go time. I never thought the first uh, Okay, one. I'm sending a title to each of your devices. Something odd, like square dancing or salami stains. Draw a picture on your device that would have that title, and when you're done, hit send. And you'll get points for each player that can correctly guess your don't. title. So, this don't mess is this up. Right. Why do oh no, we lost all your drawings. Nah, I'm just kidding. I got them all. Oh. Now, use your device to type in what you think the title for this picture could have been. Or better yet, something you think could trick the other players into thinking it's the title. You'll get points for every player that picks your answer. Alright, here are your choices. Now pick the title you think really inspired this drawing. Be like. And here are your picks. <laughs> 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 
Sha ching. How the hell? Sha ching. This is. Immediately, this first game is long. And this one. Type in a convincing title now. I've never played now. any of these party packs. And here are your choices. Oh yes, my favorite thing. Hey! What did everybody pick? Random decoy. Hey, babies puke on us all the time. It's only fair. This is immediately slim in the game. It doesn't stand for the sensor feature, though. This game has no sensor feature. Okay, here are your choices. Oh god, I like seeing the different fonts. Like, I like seeing normal Jackbox fonts and right, then my stupid fonts. The fucking Zacanius one font. Boom. Oh my god. Everybody got it right. Just because I changed it. Jackbox speedrun B2 as well. Another batch of titles are heading to your devices as I speak. Get ready to draw them. Ah! <laughs> okay, weirdos, let's take a look at your artwork. Oh. Enter anything that could almost make sense <laughs> well, now. How the drawings are lines. <laughs> hey. Here are your choices. Hey! Because it's Here's a line. Am face. I supposed to know what it is? <laughs> Random <laughs> toy? Yes, dear. Jackbox <laughs> speedrun. <laughs> Architect. <laughs> You're all wrong. Everybody's <laughs> wrong. I'm <laughs> 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 To seeing this game. Oh. And our next weird doodle. <laughs> ah! hey! And here are your choices. Ah! Hey! Because it's the only one that what makes sense. What did everybody sense. pick? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You all got it right. Don't get big heads about it. This is gonna be one of my favorite hour long runs because of the, because of the games I've never played. Like, sure, it's not a good idea to just not. Oh. Now let's uh, take a look like, at this play one. A game casually. <laughs> Okay, here are your choices. Jaundice? Who's Jaundice? Alright, wait, who picked is what? that Candice? Who oh, Candice? I like this group of players. I don't know why. I just do. Yes, because you like the fact that I'm speedrunning. There's a reason all of these are lines. Because I'm speedrunning. Let's do this drawing thing one last time. Hey! Now that I've got all your drawings, it's time for some fun. Um. Put in your titles now. And here are your choices. Hey! I'm assuming cuddly bat. And here are your picks. 
And no one got it wrong. I love how I simultaneously know this game as if I played it before, but yet actually never played it before. Um. Next up. Also, all runs of this are. Also, all runs I do are considered on an emulated and. Here are your PC. choices. What did everybody pick? I always just flip the pile over. The fresh stuff's on the bottom. <laughs> On slime, I'm having fun 1p2 seeing, oh wait, no, 1p3 seeing the oh. game. And now, this thing. Hey. And here are your choices. Yeah, because this is a shopping maniac. I hey. love my sense. Alright, who picked what? <laughs> I don't like it when everybody gets it right, but I'm a petty person. Hey! Yo, 1050! I'm being. That was slow exiting. AJLY. Let's go. Yeah, this is just a packet force. Is this entire game an auto scroller? Don't tell me this entire game is an auto scroller. This will be the first auto scroller of a Jackbox game of its kind. Jesus Christ, most other Jackbox games already had some fun. Fun, but no. I'm sp I'm here speedrunning a video game that you can't even speedrun because you have to wait. But wait, isn't that like FNAF 1? A game people have ran time and time again? Again? Like, I've ran FNAF video games as well, like Jolly 3! You! It's literally full of waiting! Mm. 
Yay. That's the whole game! I'm disappointed. Do all this work because lice water for some reason ain't working. Yeah, that works. Greetings. It was just and a welcome bug. Welcome to Lice Water, the massive true or false trivia game. We can accommodate a huge number of players in a game. And yes, I am bragging about that. All right then, before we get started, don't forget, new players can go to this website and enter this room code to join the game at any time. Let's proceed. You're going to see seven crazy facts pulled from the following fact categories. A lion yawns to trick prey into thinking it's too sleepy to eat. Use your device to pick whether you think the fact is true or a lie. <coughs> B&O Railroad is meant as an insult to Amtrak. <coughs> the Dallas-Fort Worth Airport is bigger than Manhattan. So the game's just pressing a button. During the Vietnam War, some newspapers changed Charlie Brown's name to Johnny Brown. <coughs> Jamie Lee Curtis has memorized Pi to 1500 decimal places. Glasgow has a 100-foot-tall statue of Sean Connery. <coughs> New York City schools banned the mention of dinosaurs in standardized tests. <coughs> and here's your score at the end of round one. Lice water is weird. Here are your new fact categories. JFK printed his speeches in Braille so he never had to look down. Brad Pitt's former high school is now Brad Pitt High School. The state of California tried to outlaw Starbucks. <coughs> Braille versions of Playboy magazine have been published since 1970. <coughs> Antonio Banderas released a cologne named the Musk of Zorro. Seals stab each other with sharpened coral during territory disputes. The San Diego Zoo's WGASA monorail was an acronym for Who Gives a Shit Anyway? Here is your score. Da, 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 da. 
For the final round, all the facts will be about one category. Jesus that Christ. category is Jesus International Christ. Space. Is which of these facts about the space programs really of the world sure? are true, and which ones are lies? Bjork is a scientific advisor to the Icelandic <laughs> space program. Yeah. Portugal Make claimed sure ownership of Venus in 1699. England has never sent a human into space. Canada's space program spent $95 total in 2012. Nigeria has a space program. Iran launched two turtles into space in 2010. Australia has the world's oldest space program. Yay. That's three and games here's and your not, final even score. Halfway, not even halfway in an hour. Time for my favorite, the Fibbage. I am your host, you Cookie, and I look forward to seeing the worst in each of you. Yo, well, look at you, two little peas in a pod. Delicious. Let's do this. This is round one, and that means you get 500 points for fooling your opponent with your Yo. answer. And you'll get 1,000 for finding the truth. All right, pick a category. Okay, here's your first question. In 1726, a British woman named Mary Toft convinced doctors that she had given birth to blank. Now, use your device to enter a bluff that you think will fool your opponent into thinking it's true. If you can't think of anything in time, use the lie for me button for half the points. Do it now. Okay, here are your choices. Find the truth and enter it on your device. Let's see what everybody selected. And nobody fell for some of these ingenious lies. Time to pick a category. Okay, here's the question. One of Kim Jong-il's many titles was Invincible and Ever Triumphant General and Highest Incarnation of the Revolutionary Comradely blank. Type in your lies now. All right, where's the truth? Okay, what did everyone pick?
or I-A-E-T-G-A-H-I-O-T-R-C-L for short. And that means... Select a category. Okay, here's the question. A man in Florida was arrested for calling 911 to complain that he wasn't allowed to bring his blank into a strip club. Enter your lies now. Okay, here you go. Find the truth. All right, let's see what everybody picked. And we're done. This is round two, which means all point values are doubled. Exciting. All right, pick a category. Okay, here's the question. In autumn 2013, a company that owns parking lots in England temporarily allowed drivers to pay for parking not with money, but with blank. Type in your lies now. Okay, which one's the truth? Uh, my Chrome crashed. I'm having to rejoin. Okay, let's take a look. And that means some of these didn't get picked. Time to pick a category. Okay, here's the question. A Brazilian environmental group launched a campaign in 2009 to save the rainforest by urging people to pee in blank. Enter your lies now. Okay, here are your choices. All right, who picked what? <laughs> they believe saving the Earth should be a number one priority. And the rest of the board goes unselected. Select a category. Okay, here's the question. The mountain logo on a package of Toblerone chocolate contains a hidden image of a blank. Type in your lies now. All right, where's the truth? All right, let's see what everybody picked. And that's it. Nobody else's lives got picked.
This is the final fibbage. One question left for all the marbles, and everything is worth triple. Good luck. Here's your final fibbage question. Under the Marine Corps Uniform Regulation Code, MCO P1020.34F, a male Marine is not allowed to carry this while in uniform. Enter your lies now. Okay, here you go. Find the truth. Let's see what everybody selected. And look what we have here. They're only allowed to carry a manlier alternative, the parasol. And nobody fell for this one. Don't tell me this pack is really Start short. Game has been activated. Okay, we're set. Cookie, we looked it up and implied. This is You Don't Know Jack 2015. I'm your host, Cookie Masterson. And hey, wipe that smile off your face. This is serious. Finally. Maybe just okay, just minutes. kidding. Oh. There will be farts and stuff. No name? Okay, well, here you go. It's like toe jam, but smoother. <laughs> and our wrong answer of the game is sponsored by... The San Francisco Otter Choir. Free concerts every Wednesday, except for mating season. If you happen to find our sponsor's wrong answer of the game, you'll be rewarded with big prizes and cash. <laughs> All right, we're taking off. Let's begin with Bootyful. Let's analyze one of Kim Kardashian's body parts. About what percentage of Kim Kardashian's brain is just made up of water? 10%, 40%, 80%, or 100%? What are you implying exactly? Here's where the money is. Kim Kardashian's brain, and everybody else's brain for that matter, is made up of about 80% water. But that other 20% is just so round and firm, I can't stop thinking about it. Here's a good one. His acting is all right, all right, all right. So, you know how they called Matthew McConaughey's resurgence as an actor his McConaissance? Well, if Matthew McConaughey is currently experiencing a McConaissance, then what period of his life just ended? The McConaughey Dark Ages? The McConaughey... Could be worse. You know, in theory. <laughs> this would have worked. The Renaissance first occurred in Italy in the late 14th century, immediately following the Middle Ages. So the Meconaissance would follow the Meconna Middle Ages. Which is funny because most Renaissance sculptures also need to put on a damn shirt. And now, brought to you by the letter U, Nebrow. It's the book of choices into order Then buzz in and see if you are right Question And if you get this one right I'll rustle up some extra moolah for you Arrange these Sesame Street characters In order of fewest to most eyebrows Bert, Ernie, the Count Ernie, Bert, the Count Bert, Ernie, the Count The Count, Bert, Ernie Or Ernie, the Count, Bert What? No no, no, I'll get this. 
Ernie has no eyebrows at all. Bert has one long single eyebrow. And the Count has two. Two eyebrows. <laughs> and yet, none of them have ever blinked. Here we have Duck Duck Swan. Say the cast of Duck Dynasty attends a performance of Swan Lake and thinks there are real waterfowl on stage. In their confusion, which character would they most likely shoot? Siegfried, Benno, Odette is a princess who has been turned into a swan. So the Duck Dynasty crew would probably fill her full of lead. Especially if they find out she once fooled around with a lady swan in college. I call this one, the man in the backwards yellow hat. And it's a dis or dat. I'm going to read off seven things, and for each one, you tell me if it's an alleged antic by pop star Justin Bieber, or an antic by the classic children's book character, Curious George. If it's Justin Bieber, press X or left. If it's Curious George, press B or right. Okay, let's move. Feed in a mop bucket. Rope is arrest. And that went to the baby, baby, baby. I think we can all I agree that it's time for that little bastard to get deported. And then it's your the turn, Bieber. Manipulator. That's the end of a thrilling first round. And lucky for you, there's room for improvement. Don't forget, all the questions around two are worth double. And keep in mind, big cash prizes can be yours if you find the wrong answer of the game. Okay, let's see what's next. And on its way, Dumber and dumber -er 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 2. So there's Dumb and Dumber, and then there was Dumb and dumber -er, and then Dumb and Dumber 2. Makes perfect sense. Now, going back a few decades, there was The Odd Couple and The Odd Couple 2. So, if another remake of The Odd Couple used the superlative adjective, it would be called The Blank Couple. The odd, Otter, Oddit. And that's just the dumberest question. answer I ever heard. Where's that confounded right answer? Odd is the adjective, otter is the comparative adjective, and oddest is the superlative adjective. But of course, everyone who made the original Odd Couple movies is dead, which means it's the perfect time for Rob Schneider to swoop in and revitalize the franchise. Next. Let it go, let it go, let it go. At which temperature would Olaf from the movie Frozen melt and die? 30 degrees Kelvin, 30 degrees Fahrenheit, 30 degrees Celsius, or 30 degrees? 30 degrees is below freezing in Fahrenheit and insanely below freezing in Kelvin and Rankin. But it's pretty balmy in Celsius, about the equivalent of 86 degrees Fahrenheit. <laughs> And I know, blah, 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 he can magically be saved. But I'm talking about what would happen in the real world to a talking snowman. Follow me down to the sea. Oh, Bucker up for kangaroo, peanut, Albert Einstein, or Uranus. Kangaroo, peanut, Albert Einstein, yeah. or Uranus. What is this? First spotted in 1879, kangaroo, peanuts, Albert Einstein, or Uranus? That answer has a hole in it. One right answer coming up. Albert Einstein was first spotted in 1879, the year he was born. Probably by a midwife or something over a century after Uranus was discovered and even longer after kangaroos and peanuts. I've heard baby Einstein cried a lot because he left behind some important equations on the uterine wall. Nine. 
Try this on for size. Wine or lose. I think I'm near the end if of the If the Washington game. Redskins rebranded themselves with a non-offensive redskinned the mascot, what could they be called? The Washington Chardonnays, the... Uh, nah. -uh. <laughs> Here's what you meant to pick. Chardonnays, Pinot Blancs, and Rieslings are all white-skinned grapes, but the Malbec grape is red. Although to a connoisseur like myself, Malbec is very offensive. <laughs> oh yes, I do say that was quite a burn. Ten. How about, I want to lick and roll all night. If Kiss singer Gene Simmons' tongue grew to the average length of an adult giraffe's, how deep into a woman's mouth could he stick it when he kissed her? About five inches deep, about ten? I think at that point it would practically be coming out the other end. <laughs> Why didn't you pick this? An adult giraffe's tongue is on average about 18 to 20 inches long. So that's about how deep into a woman's mouth a giraffe-tongued Gene Simmons could stick it. And if Gene Simmons' neck grew to the length of an adult giraffe's, he may not even need women anymore. Brace yourself for the attack. Oh, do you need to be somewhere? My mistake. Here's your clue. Your house is made of what? What materials are their houses made from? The for this, so let's hurry before Funny how Lice Water can, can accept 100 players. 
That means when the SquareRoom.com leaveable gets us some control club games, I have to, to set the play account to 100! All because of Lice Water! Damn! That's all.